Hey guys, today I have a tutorial for you guys and this look was inspired by the look that was created for Rihanna for her world tour by Christopher Del Castillo. He is Max senior makeup artist and um, yeah, I pretty much just looked up the face chart and it named all the stuff that they used on her. Um, I definitely don't have everything that was used on her so that's why I'm calling this an inspired look. It's not exactly the same but I did use two of the products that they used on her and I am also doing a giveaway so make sure to um, enter it. I will leave a link below. Of course I will be using Riri Wu, um, the lipstick that uh, Rihanna created along with MAC. They collaborated and created this awesome lipstick. It is called Riri Wu and it has her autograph on here. Super awesome and of course it's sold out so that's why you have to enter the giveaway. It is a retro matte which is much better than Mac's original matte formula. It just goes on um, much smoother. So yes, loving this. And it is a lipstick inspired by Mac's original lipstick, Ruby Woo, and they are very similar. But just like I said, the formula is a little bit different and the color is also a little different. I did a swatch and everything on the video for the giveaway. Um, what else, what else? I also used this, um, Pearl on Wear Paint Pot in the color Antique Diamond, which they used on her for the tour. So you will also get this. Um, what else? Well, that's it, guys. Um, make sure to enter my giveaway, and I will talk to you next time. Bye. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is take this concealer. This one is Max Pearl Longwear Concealer in NW20. I'm obviously already wearing foundation and bronzer because, you know, I didn't want to make this video super long. So I went ahead and did that before. Now I'm going to take just a little bit of this concealer like this. And then I'm going to take a flat brush and I'm going to apply that right underneath my brow just to clean it up and sharpen it up a little bit just like that. And whatever's left, I'm just going to blend it downwards. That way it will act as a base. Now I'm going to take Max Antique Diamond Pearl on Wear Paint Pot, which is the one they used on Rihanna. And what her makeup artist did was apply this from her lash line all the way to her brow. That way, you know, you have a sparkle all over the eye. But I'm actually going to concentrate it a little bit more on the lid. So the makeup artist wanted to create an eye look that was beautiful but not high maintenance. So he decided to focus more on the lashes rather than like the eyeliner and the eyeshadow. So um, this paint pot is definitely not high maintenance because you could just apply it all over the lid. It looks beautiful. It doesn't crease and I don't know. I just love it. So anyway, he created this soft smoky eye. Um, I'm actually going to be using these two colors by Inglot. I'm not sure what numbers they are but if if you want to know I will link them in the description bar so I'm going to mix these two together and just going to apply it on the crease he actually used if you want to know the exact color that he used it was a mixture between copper plate and print he pretty much just mixed these two eyeshadows together just like I'm doing here with these Inglot ones and placed it on the crease this is going to create some depth and some definition and that's pretty much all he did with the eyeshadow look itself here I'm just going to blend out those edges I don't want any harsh lines and I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other eye so that's pretty much it pretty simple yet it's still beautiful so he said he wanted to focus on the lashes not so much on the eyeliner but I am going to do a bit of a dramatic eyeliner because it's just what I like and since this is an inspired look of course it's not gonna be exactly the same so anyway I'm gonna go ahead and use this Milani uh, liquid eyeliner I'm going to place it on a palette and then going to apply it with a brush. Again, I'm going to um, go ahead and list the products I used in the description box. Now moving on to the next eye, I'm just going to go ahead and show you how I do it. Pretty self-explanatory. But of course, if you have any questions, please leave them below and I will answer as soon as possible. Now I'm going to take those two colors that I mixed together and I'm going to place it right in the bottom lash line just like this. And my eyes seem a little bit red as you can see in my bottom lash line. So I'm going to go ahead and take this nude eyeliner by NARS and I believe it's called Rue Bonaparte. And I'm going to go ahead and apply that in my waterline so I can get rid of that redness. I'm 
going to go ahead and apply some mascara. It doesn't matter which kind. I'm going to go ahead and apply it in the bottom lashes and on the top lashes. Since he wanted to focus on the lashes, he actually layered two pair of false lashes. But since the ones I'm going to use are pretty dramatic, I'm just going to stick to one pair. So I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. They're on. Now moving on to the cheeks. And the blush he used was in the color Pinch Me, but I don't have that. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one right here. It is in the color Melba. It's a beautiful color. I'm going to go ahead and apply it on my cheeks using this Delium Tools brush, which I love, by the way. These brushes are awesome. Anyway, now I'm going to take this um, brush right here. It's kind of like a kabuki brush, but it has a long handle. And I'm going to blend everything out so I won't have any harsh lines. Now moving on to the lips, I'm taking, of course, Riri Woo lipstick and I'm going to first apply it directly from the tube just like this today I'm not going to use a lip liner I'm just going to use the lipstick so I'm going to go ahead and do that first it's going to look a little bit you know kind of messy but then I'm going to take this brush right here a small lip brush or I don't even know if it's a lip brush but it's a really small one and I'm going to go ahead and um, kind of line my lips with it and just perfect the lines I just love how this lipstick looks on its own, but on Rihanna, they used the lip liner Vino and also a lip gloss in the color Rebel. But I'm not going to do that because, again, I love how this lipstick looks on its own. Now I'm going to take this highlight by Laura Mercier in the color Highlight 01, and I'm going to go ahead and take that. Oh, that's what it looks like right there. And I'm going to apply it on the top of my cheeks just like that in a C shape. And that's pretty much it. And now, so we won't have any harsh lines, I'm just going to blend everything out. Okay, guys, this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. And don't forget to enter the giveaway for Riri Wu and Antique Diamond. Um, I will leave the link below, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!